What's going on YouTube? Gabriel say, aka The Truth, checking in with a full day of eating. Remember to always be true, no matter what you do. I run it, I never front it. I got my whole cool life on it. Big shot, man, listen. So today I'm taking you through my reverse diet. Um, when I finished the show, um, I did eat pretty well. Although in the evenings I was addicted to pizza, I don't, I don't know what was wrong, what's wrong with me, but literally addicted to pizza. So um, I tried to keep it fairly carb free during the day, and so I could have my pizza in the evening. When it came to the day I was leaving, I tried to keep it carbless, but it was it was tough, and I was hungry. <laughs> You know, you only live once, but then the flight back just made me made me hold a lot of water. So this reverse diet <clears throat> is kind of to bring the water retention down. Which um, when I was out there, they actually uh, um, one of the booths gave me these like herbal um, diuretic um, pills. So I'm actually testing those um, over the next few days to see how it helps with my water retention. Um, so far so good, I only used it yesterday and already um, started to come down a little bit so this is to kind of stabilize me, bring my water retention down and then gradually go into increasing my calories to make the improvements I need for my next show which will be the English Grand Prix which is 16 weeks away. So enough of me talking I'm gonna take you for my breakfast all right so meal one is this is lean beef mince with fried up with onions and avocado and then some Greek yogurt with blueberries and a little bit of honey so that's my breakfast in terms of macros um, I'm working with about 23 to 2400 calories on a 50, 25, 25 split. So 50% protein, 25% carbs, 25% fats. Seems to be working. I can now see my abs again. Yeah, I bloated that much. But, um, <laughs> yeah, um, this will probably be for another week or so. And then we'll move into the build phase of my diet but it's enjoyable keeps me full and I'm hungry so I will see you at meal two alright guys so now on to meal two so this is kind of my pre pre-workout meal so I'll get two carb meals in before my workout so let's see what I've got so I've got two tins of tuna, um, I've got some giant couscous in there and some cabbage and leek and also two servings of mayonnaise just to make it taste better. All tracked in my fitness pal so it's all part of my macros. So yeah that's it. Alright so now I'm going to eat this and I will see you at meal three for my pre-workout meal. Peace. All right, guys, I decided that I'm gonna go and train now. So this is about 45 minutes after my last meal and I just, I'm, I'm really craving some um, protein pancakes. So I'm gonna have that as my post-workout treat. Um, just before I leave, I've got to sort out my supplements, so um, I need my aminos, I need my pre-workout and I need my post-workout shakes. So I'll show you what I have for that. reason I wanted to train right now is because I just downloaded Kano's new track called Hail. Oh my gosh. Club banger. I'll play it in the car. When we get into the car, I'll play it for you. But, um, also, side note, a few of you have been asking me what my... Um, music playlist is what I listen to in the gym and stuff like that 
if you want to see that on a show of hands, when you put your hand up, now just give me a like um, in the on the video and give me a comment, just saying I want to hear your playlist. Um, I'll then put something together, put a video together where I'll go through like my top ten tracks for um, when I'm lifting and explain you know like why I listen to those tracks at specific points because music is a huge driver for me um, through workouts through through life in general and I'll explain that more in another video but on to pre-workout and post-workout supplements right, I'm gonna try and do this fast holding the camera alright so pre-workout got some pre-grow from Isotory thanks to Erin at Isotory for that and then for my post-workout shake, we've got Hypergrow by Isotory as well. For my, um, for my aminos, I have, um, it was by Optum Nutrition, I think it's the um, Amino Energy, which is pretty good. Has a little bit of caffeine in it, so it keeps me going through the workout. Um, I don't actually have the top because I had samples from the Arnold Expo and I just put them into just any old tub. So the tub actually says glutamine, but it actually has amino energy. So I'm going to mix that up, get it all ready, and I'm going to head to the gym. But yeah, I'm going to play that Kano track for you in the car, so stay tuned. Back in a sec. Oh man, Kano is back. Kano is back and back with a vengeance. Jeez. Taking it back to the old school grime where he started. Jeez. But yeah, that track, I just listened to it and it just got me hyped. And I was like, nah, gym time, food can wait. I'm gonna hit the session and then and then treat myself to the protein pancakes afterwards. So I'm gonna go smash hamstrings and calves and I'll see you at the next meal. Peace. All right, so I just finished a big hamstring and calf workout <sighs> we shattered um, met up with my boy um, Big Guns Diesel just happened to be at the gym at the same time I've actually moved gyms now so I've left Easy Gym and I am now at um, Metroflex Lower Sydenham Road <laughs> so let the gains begin off season for the next say eight weeks building and then into my shred for the English Grand Prix but enough of me talking I've got my pro mix shaker a little bit of water I'm gonna have my isotory uh, hyper grow one scoop and then get home to have my pancakes so I'm gonna drink this and then I will see you back for the next meal and right, guys you really need to taste this Damn, it tastes good. It's the cookies flavor, but mm. I thought the Optim Nutrition Gold Standard cookie flavor was good, but damn. So now I'll see you at the next meal. Peace. All right, so on to next meal which is the pancakes that I've been craving all day. So these are my, if you haven't seen the recipe, it's my banana oat pancakes. I just put a bit of peanut butter on top. Mm, mm, mm. I've got 25 grams of whey isolate in there as well. All right, time to eat. See you at the next meal. All right guys, so on to the next meal. Just relaxing, watching NCIS and getting some work done. But let's have a look. This is my last solid meal. I'm probably just gonna have a casein whey shake after this. That's just salmon with some parmesan cheese. 
bit of pesto and cucumber. It's nice and simple. So yeah, it's most likely gonna be casein whey just before bed, along with my vitamins. Done about four and a half liters of water today. Still trying to keep that up. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna eat this and then I will see you at the next shake, not meal. All right guys, so now I'm gonna have my casein shake. I have a uh, reflex. Tastes a bit chalky, a little bit dusty, but you know, it does the job and it tastes, flavors all right. I've been up, doing a lot of work, so I'm really tired, so I'm just gonna drink that and head to bed. So that concludes my full day of eating for my reverse diet. Not sure how long this is gonna last. Probably a couple of weeks, but Scott will let me know when it changes and then my calories will start to go up as I enter my prep for my next show. Hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it was informative. If I do have another day where I feel like my meals are going to be quite interesting with quite interesting recipes then and it's still within the reverse diet, I'll be sure to put that up. So. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure you do. Make sure you like, comment, share, and until next time. Remember to always be true, no matter what you do. I never front it, I got my whole cool.